Hi, my name is Shar, and I am a journalism student at Tsinghua University, and I'm here to tell you how to spot a fake news. This was the largest audience to ever witness an inauguration, period. Let's begin by understanding what is fake news. You are fake news. I like real news, not fake news. You're fake news. The fake news, the enemy of the people. Every time you are online, you are bombarded with pictures, articles, links, and videos trying to tell their story. Unfortunately, not all of these stories are true. Sometimes they want you to click on another story or an advertisement at their own site. Other times, they want to upset people for political reasons. These days, it is easy to share information. These stories circulate quickly, and the result is fake news. Now that we know what is fake news, let's find out the right tools and information that we need to know so that we can spot a fake news from a mile away. Before you share an article claiming Lil Wayne has a month to live or the Queen of England has risen from the dead, take a look at these tips. Tip number one, check the source. Ask yourself, where is the news coming from? Consider how you found the news. Did it show up on your social media news feed? On Facebook, on Instagram, or on TikTok, on a site known for clickbait? Check the domain name of the site you're reading. Often, unusual domains such as .com.co are fake news. Tip number two, check other sources. Check out if there are other reputable news or media outlets reporting on the story. Are the credible sources cited within the story? Professional global news agencies have editorial guidelines and extensive resources for fact-checking. So if they are also reporting on the story, that's a good sign meaning that is not fake news. Tip number three, maintain a critical mindset. A lot of fake news is cleverly written to provoke strong emotions, reactions, such as fear or anger. Maintain a critical mindset by asking yourself, why has this story been written? Is it promoting a particular cause or agenda? Is it trying to make me click through to another website? Was it the writer's opinion? It could also be biased and misleading, trying to push a certain political view or to be leaning towards a certain political party. If the news story seems as though it was written with some sort of bias or opinion attached to it, it may not be a trustworthy news source. Tip number four, check the facts. Credible news stories will include plenty of facts data, statistics, quotes from experts, and so on. If this are missing, question why? Reports with false information often contain incorrect dates or altered timelines, so it's a good idea to check when the article was published. Is it a current or old news story? Tip number five, utilize media literacy sites. When fake news stories start to go viral, these sites typically pick up what's real and what's not. Not only can you tell whether a story is true or not, but these sites often do the research for you so you're able to find out the whole story. Fake news relies heavily on believers reposting, retweeting, and otherwise sharing false information. If you're not sure whether an article is authentic or not, pause and think before you share. Also, don't believe everything everyone say. Remember, check their credentials. Even check my credentials. Look me up. Who am I? Am I a real student of Tsinghua University? Am I a real person at all? My name is Shar and I am a journalism student at Tsinghua University, reminding you once again to think twice before you click.